welcome everyone so here we are i am actually going to put in my bok choy into my raised bed garden so what i use is a mix of black cow manure and miracle grow for outdoors so all i'm doing right now is just mixing it up a little bit and because i didn't take out my tomato plants yet whew, which I probably should have because the roots will be all up and through. But I'm just, I don't know. I still want to see how many potatoes, I mean, tomatoes I could get. This might be my last little batch because these little tiny ones aren't really doing much. So, but anywho, today I am going to try my hand at putting my bok choy into the dirt. So, um, what I do is just slice off the little tail piece here and I just ate the rest so instead of just tossing it I've learned that we could actually try to regrow our own and just snip new leaves as they grow eat them and it'll just regrow that's the thought some have been successful just leaving it in water but I haven't the last time I tried it started flowering and then it just rotted out so I am going to try to plant it outside now that the temperatures have dropped quite a bit because I did it right in the middle of the heat. So all I really need to do is get to the heart of the bok choy. And I'm just removing the outer. As you can see, these little sprouts have already sprouted along the way and up and through the middle. Maybe I'll take this one off. So that should be a sufficient start. And I'm gonna do the same with this one. And this was actually sprouted out like the next day, literally, I could see new growths um, sprouting. So this is day three and I got nervous. I probably could have left it in there a little longer, but I didn't want it to rot and it was already starting to turn a little brown. So we're gonna try to do something different and throw it right in there. Um, what I do like to do is toss in some coffee grind. in my soil and this adds some extra nutrients As you can see my neighbor hooked me up <laughs> thank you and I'm gonna toss that in there should be enough and this X um, gives some nitrogen back into the soil it's getting a little cold I may have to get a little cover I don't know I'm learning as I go so we're just gonna see this will be my first fall garden. So it's actually my first summer garden too. Um, and I'm just trying out what I can do and we'll go from there. So we're learning together. Thank you for watching and tuning in. <clears throat> okay, so I I'm going to save these and add these to my compost bin. So no worries, waste not, want not. That's my mantra. And since I only have two, I am going to dig a little trench. See, look at that. My tomato roots have already grown out quite a bit, but no worries gonna dig her right down in here probably it's about a good four inches put some of the soil down in here as a matter of fact let me mix this up my doing I need to add some more anyway so when I started out my bed I didn't fill it completely all the way up which <clears throat> I need it to, as you can see, my tomato plants kind of should be dug a little deeper than what they are, but I was successful. Next spring, I'll put them in even deeper. So I'm just going to mix up my soil just a bit. I didn't have anything back here. I tried to put some tomatoes, but... I started them from seed and they didn't last. So that's the only thing that was back here in this space. So 
So we're going to try my bok choy out. I've been really enjoying eating it in my stir fries and soups. So instead of spending an arm and a leg, let's just grow our own. So there's one. I'm prayerful that it'll last, that it'll work this time. <laughs> I'm laughing because the first time it rotted like right out, but it was like 90 degrees. So I don't really expect much to survive in weather like that. Especially freshly cramps, planted items, but bok choy is a cold winter, a cold weather plant. I am doing this rather late for zone seven, but I'm curious to see the results. So thank you for tuning in with me. I'm going to pack it in a little bit and I think it's good to go we'll see um just gonna water it a bit and I think that's it guys um so thank you for tuning in we'll keep watching and checking our progress and pray as we go all praises to the most high thank you Oh, 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 oh,